Hey guys, it's Jill. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. So today we are going to be doing a Fashion Nova try-on. And if I can say one thing, this dress I'm about to show you is everything. It is so beautiful. It is Jill. It has Jill written all over it. Um, anyways, I'm going to go ahead and step back so you guys can see the dress. If you guys would so kindly give me a big thumbs up. Um, help my channel grow. We are so close to 50. I know I keep saying this in every video. Maybe by the time this goes up, I will be at 50,000. I don't know. But y'all, we are so, so close. We are closer than ever now. And yeah, it's just, we are less than a thousand away. It's crazy. It's crazy to think about. All right. So yeah, if you are not subscribed, I would love if you would subscribe. I'm going to step back and we're going to get on with this try on. Everything for reference is a size 3X, unless I tell you otherwise, the pants are usually 2X or 22, 22s. So yeah, this Valentine's Day is coming up, you guys. And if you want a sexy little bodycon, I will link it down below. Seriously, I don't know the name of it. I pulled the tag off just before I came out here. Um, I will put it on the screen or I will come back and tell you when I try on the other dress, but this is just perfect. It has nice stretch to it, but it's not the kind of stretch just like a flimsy stretch. This is a nice suck you in, hold you in type dress. I don't have any shapewear on, and I feel like I'm okay without it. I also love, and I need more dresses to do this, okay? There is molding and padding in here so you don't even need to wear a bra I'm currently not wearing a bra and can we please have more dresses that are like this I remember back in the 90s they used to have cami tank tops where they would have padding and they'd have this lining and man I used to love those especially when I was smaller and I had like really small boobs Y'all, I can get away without wearing a bra, and it was amazing. So I would love to see more of this, especially in these kind of dresses, especially the ones where they are see-through in the back right here. So you have no signs of any kind of bra. You don't have to buy a specific fancy bra or a different kind of bra. You can just wear this as is. And I'm telling you, like, I feel like my boobs look great. I don't feel like I need, like, any kind of, like, push up or anything. These are adjustable straps, so I could probably get away with adjusting the straps a little more. But I mean, this is just gorgeous. It's so gorgeous. Like I said, it's not, it's stretchy, but that's real attractive, Jill. <laughs> but I have to show you guys it's stretchy. Um, yeah, stretchy without being like too stretchy because it's really one of those suck you in kind of dresses. So again, you can not only forego the shapewear, but you can also forego the bra as well. I'm obsessed. It has a little gold thing that you adjust the straps with. I just love this all around. Did you guys see it has lace right here and then also like lace all throughout here? Stunning. Absolutely, absolutely stunning. And I feel so incredibly sexy in this dress. Come through Fashion Nova. Coming through with the Valentine's dresses. This gorgeous dress is called the Charge Me Up Belted Dress. And the last dress was called the Looking So Perfect Lace Dress, which is a perfect name for it because I think you look so perfect in that dress. Okay, this dress. Ivory, beautiful, double straps right here. Love the little... You guys see that? Now you do need to wear, because there's no like padding or anything, that's literally just um, kind of like lining, I guess, a kind of like an outline um, to add like a little bit of detail to this part. You also have this part right here, which I think is so cool, a little triangle. And then you also have these two belts, gold buckles, and then it is double lined, but as you can see, I am wearing gray underwear. So that means you can see straight through this dress, but no worries because all you have to do, because again, it is double lined, just wear some nude seamless underwear and you will be good to go. I love, love, love the length on this dress. 
And then this is the bag. It has a nice slit to it. Um, it has a gold zipper, which I really love as well. And this is an exceptional quality dress. When I pulled it out of the bag, I was like, oh, wow. So yeah, definitely great price, great quality. Same with that lace dress. It was really great quality as well. But this dress, obviously, because of the buckles and stuff, it's heavy, but also the, the fabric is just thicker and a little bit better quality. They're both great quality. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to mention that. This I feel so beautiful in. And this would be a really good Valentine's dress too. You could throw on some red heels. Although I'd probably more so do that with black than I would with white. But um, I think red heels would still look good with this. Or you could do just some red lips and make it a Valentine's dress that way. I did also want to mention that when I was putting it on, I felt like the straps were a little big. Um, here and there, I feel as I like move throughout the day or whatever, see, it's going to go down. So the straps are a little bit big on me. Not to where I feel like it would be bothersome, but as you move throughout the day or as I would move throughout the day, this, this strap right here would definitely have come down. But, I mean, I actually don't think that's that bad of a look. I per Well, I personally don't like it as much. Okay, so this is so disappointing. I wanted this shirt so, so bad. And when I pulled it out of the bag, I was like, this is a 3X because it's not supposed to be a crop. <laughs> no, it's not. It's so cute, though. It's, like, distressed right here. And this is called the World rock tee or something like that and yeah it's entirely too short i also bought one that looks identical to this that has long sleeves and that one's a 2x so that one's even smaller so yeah anyways it's a really cute tee if you can get your hands on it i think this one sells out very quickly so um i think this was like a back in stock type thing you can get your hands on it and you like it and you because this I would say size up one to two sizes for sure like absolutely no doubt about it these jeans are the distressed Daniela mid-rise skinny jean size 22 and one thing I want to say to you that I've kind of noticed with Fashion Nova jeans is that Fashion Nova jeans are definitely made for a taller woman and even when you look at the models if they're a long jean they're even scrunched up on the models that they have on the website. So to me, that was my number one clue that, well, if it's scrunched up like that on the model, it is definitely not going to fit my 5'4 behind in the length. So we're not even going to try those jeans out anymore. So any jeans that I looked at with the model where they hit her in a nice place and they weren't scrunched, where they were like more like ankle jeans on her, then I was like, okay, those are going to fit me perfectly in the length. And the model that was wearing these jeans, they were not scrunched up on her, they were more like ankle jeans, and ta-da, they fit perfectly in the length. These jeans are very distressed. They have distressing here, and like all down the leg, all the way down to the floor or to the bottom of the jean, and then it also extends to the back. So you have a little distressing on the pockets, and then you also have distressing on the bottom of the hemline on, the, on your jeans. Um, I like them. I like them a lot. I think these will look so cute with some Chuck Taylors or some Vans. Why am I so hot? They don't offer a whole lot of stretch, and because they're mid-rise, they, they don't go as high as I would like for them to in the back. They kind of dip down a little lower than I'd like them to, but other than that, I think that they're a great jean. So that is a great tip if you guys are looking for Fashion Nova jeans where you don't have to like additionally go and get them hemmed for them to fit you properly on the length, look at the models that have the jeans where they're not scrunched up. Because if you go on the website and you notice a lot of the models, their jeans are scrunched up and it's like, 
hope that tip helps helps you out. And I wish I had higher, like I had high hopes for this top. It's so cute. It's soft. It's like, it says world tour. It's like distress. And then I have my black strapless bra on, which you can kind of see, but it's not like in a too sexy way because it's like you can see it but you can't okay so i figured out the name of this the correct name is on tour t that's what that one was called this one's called the on tour long sleeve t and as you can see 2x just no just no so yeah like i said this is a 2x anyways so i kind of knew when i picked it out that this was going to be something that i was going to have to work my way down into but i didn't know i would have to work my way down into this much this top is called the lay love on me top size 3x you guys if you get anything from this haul i'm telling you that first dress second dress possibly because that's a really good one too these jeans are good but this top this top i already have it in like a wine burgundy those are the two colors that they that they offer this shirt in and I had to have them in both. This shirt, I think, is a great staple to have. Not that it's going to go, like, everywhere, because obviously you couldn't wear it to work if you can't do the off-the-shoulder, and you wouldn't want to wear it to church if you can't do off-the-shoulder, if you don't want to do off-the-shoulder. So it's not, like, a super versatile top, but I think it's one of those go-to if you don't know what to wear on a date or if you don't know what to wear a girl's night out. This is a perfect top for that because it's kind of dressy. It's very flattering. But then it's also not like over the top and it's also good for like a night out or a, or a date. I just, I love this top so much. Like I said, I got it. I have it in two colors now. Um, but yeah, it has the little elastic around the, let me show it to you without my watch because my watch can kind of distort, I feel, <laughs> the way that things look, especially when I'm wearing that white band. But this is how they look on the sleeves. Um, the sleeves are see-through. And then it has this, it's, it's just, it's so flattering, it's so stunning, like how this kind of like is layered and it's just so beautiful. This belt is detachable, it is a peplum, it is longer in the back, but it's not so long that it's not flattering if you have a big butt, and if you have a big butt and you know exactly what I'm talking about, this top is just, it's perfection and I will recommend it for as long as they sell it. It is just gorgeous. I wish that they would come out with colors like green and red and maybe even a yellow, a pink. This would look good in Sony. Oh, uh, a royal blue. I would own them in every color. Every color they come out with, I will be getting because this is just, it's perfect. It's so me and I think it's so incredibly flattering. So, um, yeah, also when you bend over, you're not like, it's not like extending because it has this, I don't know if it's plastic, I don't know what it is, but there's something in there making this very sturdy. So when you bend over, it's not like the whole top is falling over because this is a very light, delicate kind of fabric. Also, the off the shoulder part is elastic. So if you're wider up top or smaller up top, like not as broad up top, it'll conform to however you need it to. Um, also, plenty of room left in the arms, which I love as well. And you can also take the sleeves and kind of put them up like that. And that's a really good look too. I love this shirt. Love it, love it, love it. This top actually didn't come with a tag on it at all, but I remember what this name, what the name of this is because my daughter's name is Ava and this is the Ava. I think it was like Ava off the shoulder top. But it's just a really great basic black top. Again, this is something great for like girls night out or a date or something like that. It's super casual, but it's still sexy and sexy without like showing too much. You know, it's still, it has the elastic up here, stays off the shoulder, which is nice. It has these little silver buttons that are just sewn on there. It is stretchy. This is a size 3X. I would like it to fit a little better, um, but it is super soft and it's just a basic black off the shoulder top that again, I feel things like this for me are just go-tos and they're basic, but I like to dress like this when I go out 
and I love to be able to just have something to like, okay, I know I have this, I know I have this, and I know I have this. So if I'm going out for the night, I know I can choose between like, you know, multiple tops and be like, okay, this is a great basic, this is a great basic. Um, this is also something you can layer. So you, you know, work in an office or work in a church or something, you can totally cover up. And then if you want to go to brunch after church, you can totally kind of be like, oh, hey, let the shoulders shine. And yeah, this is what it looks like in the back, just plain and basic, but I love it, especially the fact that it's named the Ava off the shoulder top because my baby girl. This shirt also does not have a tag in it, and I noticed that they're by the same brand. They're not Fashion Nova brand. They are ambiance, ambiance. So again, this one, I have no idea what the name of it is, but I will find it and link in, not link it down below, but put it in the description box. Um, this, I will say, I thought was more of a bright kind of pastel yellow. That's kind of what it looked like on the website. And when I got it, I was kind of like, oh, because it's mustard. And mustard works with me sometimes. Sometimes it doesn't. It depends on where my skin tone is. I feel like, I don't know. I feel like if I had a little bit, like a, a little bit of a tan, maybe this would look good. I think that darker skin tones pull off mustard way better than uh, lighter, paler skin tones do. Um, this does not have stretch to it, but I actually like the way that it fits. And also, when it goes off the shoulder, it is not elastic, but it has plenty of room. So there's still, as you can see, like a good bit of room left in the arm, so it's not uncomfortable. These do not have adjustable straps. It's just like a little spaghetti strap right there. I also like where this hits, and I also like in the back, it has like this little tie up. Can you see that? It's really cute. And then it also hits at a great spot in the back, where it's not too long, and it's not high-low, it's actually like the same length as it is in the front. So I really, really love that. I just wish it was more of a pastel type yellow. Those kind of yellows, I look really great in and I always have. By the way, I apologize. I'm doing laundry. It's the weekend. I gotta get it done. I'm so behind on it. So we just have to we just have to multitask. So I hope it's not bothering you. But these right here are the Miss Cello brand or Cello, it's C-E-L-O-O. -O, size 22. They're the cropped skinny. These, these jeans are everything. They do have a nice stretch to them. They are frayed on the bottom. <clears throat> they also have some distressing down here. They're a great like medium to dark tone. <sighs> Love the distressing on these. However, they did not fit me. They went up to maybe about right here, which is so unfortunate, but it's okay because these are just another gold pair of pants of mine. I would say these probably fit like an 1820. And not a 22. So yeah, unfortunately, like I said, I'm gonna hold on to them and get down into those. But these right here, I wanted to try Fashion Nova's activewear, and a lot of their activewear is like joggers and stuff like that. And now that that's not my style, but I just like to wear the workout leggings when I'm going to work out instead of a jogger. And I really don't even like to hang out in joggers. So they're just not my style. They look great on other people, but I just don't think they look good on me. These are I Need a Soldier Active Legging, <clears throat> size 3X, and they're the Fashion Nova. What does it say? Oh, Nova Sport. It says Nova Sport Los Angeles. I don't know if you guys can see this. Can you guys see? Like, these are stretched to capacity. And you can literally see my leg up underneath here. Maybe that was the coloring. I don't know, you can see it, like right here. Can you guys see? That is like my leg. So, yeah, these are just, they feel good, but they're definitely not a, well, they're not a, like a 22-24 type 3X. They're more like a 18-20 3X. Um, this is what it looks, in the, looks like in the back. I don't know, like, 
Are they squat proof? They're probably not. Just trying to get you guys to see like how see-through they are because they're stretched out so much. Because when I was looking at them, I was like, oh, these are really great quality and these are really, these are gonna be really great for me at the gym, but I've been wanting some camo leggings. I bought some from Walmart. They sent me an email telling me they were sold out. Got them from Fashion Nova, now they're still too big, so. These are probably gonna go on Poshmark too, because honestly, by the time I fit in these, it's probably gonna be spring, summer, and I don't like to wear full leggings. They're just too hot for me, so I only wear like the crops. But yeah, I do like the waistband. The waistband's really good. It's really thick, wide, and then it also, you know, they're high rise. They're good, they're really good quality. They're just not a size 3X that I need them to be. That will do it for this haul. What are we thinking? I really love the jeans. I cannot wait to get into those other jeans. I didn't tell you what they were, hold on. Oh, they don't say, of course. I don't know, I don't know what the, what the name of the jean is. But again, it'll be in the description box somewhere. Um, yeah, so what did you guys think? I really loved those jeans, with the exception that they're size or two too small. Um, I love, love that off the shoulder top, that dress, both of the dresses. So definitely happy with the haul. Um, yeah. Um, so I wanted to announce to you guys that by the time this goes up, it might actually be in February. But this coming up week is my last week of work. Um, so if you guys didn't know, like I was working a full-time job and doing YouTube. Whew, doing both was so... I'm ready for a normal life again. That's all I can say. Um, but yeah, this is my last week coming up and it's like so bittersweet because I'm like... I'm excited because I want to focus my energy full-time on YouTube. But then I'm also kind of like sad because... I've met some really great people there, like some really, really great people. And it's been nice, you know, getting out of the house and being around people and yeah, that is ending. With that being said, I know I've been slacking on my Poshmark. I am going to be killing it in, in February. Not only am I moving the 1st of March, so I want to go ahead and start decluttering, but I just have so much. Like I have two or three huge trash bags just full of clothes that I want to sell. So yeah, look out for that. Follow me on Instagram because that is where I'm going to post the announcement of everything going live first. Um, also, link down below if you guys do not have the app. Link is down below for you guys to go ahead and download the app. And when you do that, you use that link to download the app. And when you make a purchase, you will be able to use Miss Green Eyes 15 in a coupon code area and you'll be able to save $10. If you do have the app, you will not use the link and you will just go to Poshmark under search people and put at Miss Green Eyes 15 to find me. So, so many of you find, have issues with finding me. There's not an actual direct link that I can link you guys to. You just have to go and search me. So I hope that that helps. I hope that that makes sense. We are doing a massive, massive closet clean out. So I just wanted to bring you, bring it to your attention to let you guys know because that will be coming up very soon. Like within, by the time this video goes up, maybe next week, maybe within the week. Um, Cause I'm thinking at this point, it's gonna be like two to two and a half weeks before because I wanna go ahead, get a bulk, like go ahead and get everything put on there and then I want to focus on decluttering and moving and stuff like that because this move is going to come quick. It's going to come quick. So, by the way, all the thoughts and prayers, but by the time that this video grows up, you guys will know whether I got the house or not. But, yeah, Ugh, this house, it's so gorgeous. And it's, it's mine. I'm saying it's mine. But it's not 100% sure yet. So, so, all I can say is fingers crossed. I hope it's mine. If not, we're going to have to do some more searching, which I'm not excited about because I don't want to do that. I, I want this house. So, anyways, love you guys. Hope you have an amazing day. Hope you enjoyed this haul. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.